Hello, welcome to another World of Warplanes re uh, replay with your host Bjorn. And today, I am flying my Corsair. Plane made pretty infamous by the Black Sheep Squadron. Used quite a bit by the Marine Corps. So, uh, let's see how this game goes. No, just a quick show. It's a Tier 6 game. The F4U is... Um, <laughs> for the memes. Um, how do I want to put it? It's, it's got decent survivability. It's not extremely fast. It's not extremely maneuverable. It's actually got a fairly low ceiling height. Even though its ceiling height you should be actually the equivalent of a P-40. If not even better than the P-40. Um, this plane was used by the Marines. Um in the Pacific Theater, and uh, yeah, the Black Sheep Squadron shot uh, quite a few Japanese Zeros down. So now what I'm doing here is I'm just using my rockets for ground attack. I'm gonna do a quick strafe with my cannons. Do some more strafe with my cannons. And here some, come some ground attack fighters. Now this plane, this plane is I don't want to put it, it, it's not very good at fighting fighter, fighters because it's not very maneuverable, it's not very fast. It doesn't have a very good ceiling height. But what it does do is it will bully and just absolutely delete ground fighters, um, the ground attack. And it will, it can go head to head with any low flying, um, Heavy fighters. I have mine upgraded with four 20 millimeter cannons. Now, as you can see, the 20 mils, um, I can't fire a lot of shells at once, um, but they really pound away on what I'm shooting. Here we go after another ground fighter. See, I gotta let my cannons cool down. I'm hitting my air brake to slow down. And I end up having to break off my attack here. And I'm just gonna spin it around. And I'm gonna get back right on him. Just get rid of him. Pull up a bit. Oh, heavy fighter coming in, so I went after the heavy fighter. I mean, this, this plane is actually very good in the situation where I'm just kind of playing base defense now. We got the two cap points. Um, so right now I'm just keeping an eye out for he low flying fighters, heavy fighters. And if ground any ground attack come in, which there's a ground attack, I get right on them and just delete them. Um, a bit more. So there's a JU-87G. There you go. I just deleted him. And his tail gun barely did any damage to me, actually. And see, there's another ground fighter. I'm going right on him. Hot and heavy. Let him have it with the 20 mils. I want to just break it, swing it wide. Allow my guns to cool, then I tighten up. Go right in after him again. Staying right on his rear the whole time. Just delete him, pull it up. And right there's another ground fighter. Delete him. And now I'm back in that circle around the base. Anything that flies low is gonna find you know, find out what these 20 mils are all about. Try to actually gain some altitude and go after this fighter here. If I recall, yep, that's a bomber in the base. So I just, I just let him go. I just, I don't have the altitude in this point to go after a bomber. So 
I just keep going after this heavy fighter. And, and once again, it's I'm just going for um, base control. See, now I'm about as maneuverable as this heavy fighter. Now, the heavy fighter on me has speed. Way to go. Um, I don't know why he tried to, like, think he was going to outturn my Corsair. Um, I take a little bit of damage here, but I just roll it around. See, now at the moment, he's, he's behind me, but... I took some heavy damage there from him, but it's all right. It's Corsair. I can take it. And I just stay on him, and I keep turning on him. Let him have it with the 20s. Downed him. So now there's a fighter coming in. I really don't want to mess with this fighter. And, and for a moment there, I was actually going to turn off and try to run. I just said, fuck it, and went after him. And I actually, like, literally went, what? I was pretty sure he was going to try to gun me down. And I ended up setting him on fire and killing him with the fire. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to return to the center. There's, once again, there's ground attack fighters. So it's back to these guys need to be deleted. And I'm just trying to debate which one's the best one to go after first. I go after this HS. Choppy there. I'm proud of you, pilot. Head back home. And that's the end of the game. It's not bad. <laughs> At the end, I had to say, get wrecked, boy. So there you go. So I took out nine aerial targets, six while defending. Um, got quite a few combat points, got quite a bit of experience. Uh, maybe even quite a bit of credits. So this is, uh, I'd rather enjoy the Corsair. I think it's a good plane. Everybody should get one. It's a very good multi-role plane. Um, it's not the best, but it's not bad. Uh, as you can see, it was a pretty killer game. And, and lazy old guy there with the Mustang 1. Kudos to you, man. You had a pretty baiting game yourself. And even even the, num the number two guys had some pretty baiting games. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you on the next one.